Wisconsin takes back the axe from Minnesota and punches their way to Indianapolis. Minnesota game planned well for running back Jonathan Taylor. He only finished with 76 yards, but the rest of the offense was dynamic. It took a lot of people, and uh, you thought all three phases obviously had a big hand in it and thought they did a great job of, of being resilient and just continuing to play. It takes everyone to win these games, and, and we got a ton of contributions from different guys. I mean, they were loading the box trying to stop JT, obviously, so we knew that the passing game needed to step up. Junior wide receiver Quintez Cephas showed out with five catches, 114 yards, and this pretty touchdown. Yeah, I mean, it felt good coming out of my hand, and, you know, whenever you're throwing the ball to Q, you know, he's, he's got a good chance to come down with it, so. With all phases executing, Coach Christ and his team were able to do the one thing they came here for. We came up here with one purpose, and that was to to win this game and, and bring the axe back home. It means so much to me just to send those seniors out with the axe, being able to chop down the goalpost. Uh, just an unbelievable feeling. After giving up the axe a year ago, the Badgers take it back. The Badgers are now 6-0 against the Gophers when both teams are ranked in the top 25. And up next for Wisconsin, it is mighty Ohio State for the Big Ten Championship from TCF Bank Stadium. This is Declan Levy, WXOW News 19. All right, thanks Declan. As for the Gophers, they fall short of a trip to the Big Ten title game. Here's what head coach P.J. Fleck and quarterback Tanner Morgan had to say after the brutal loss. But you got to take your hat off to Wisconsin. They're very, very good, very talented. Um, and this is why it's a rivalry. Uh, it goes back and forth, and that's what we hope is back, that rivalry. But Paul Christ and his entire staff did a great job. Congratulations to them as they represent the West in Indianapolis. So this isn't just an end-all, be-all, right? We're doing everything we can to set a new standard and an expectation here of what Minnesota Golden Gopher football looks like. We didn't win the game. We didn't do the little things right, didn't take advantage of our opportunities. Um, but I know this, we will respond from this. Um, this team will fight back and claw back and um, respond like no other 